this needs to be on the beach somewhere. Can we get into it? Like, oh no, I love it, I love it. Yeah, it works for me, this works for me. Good morning, how are you all doing? It's another vlog for you, I hope you are doing well. I've got some good stuff happening that I'm really excited about and um, I'm just gonna be on the go making stuff happen and also I wanted to bring you along on some of the journeys when it comes to some of the treatments and some of the products and stuff that I'm using at the moment and I've made mention so many times about the fact that you know post having a baby i have diastasis i'm very prone to diastasis because i have super narrow hips and an anterior pelvic tilt i don't know what that means but you know post having babies and stuff like that uh, my body just it doesn't have that snap back um and i'm pretty comfortable with it uh, although i've had to be really strict in my eating and my working out and my exercise and i'm not gonna lie it's boring i'm not gonna i'm i'll be real with you it's boring i don't want to i don't want to i don't want to lose weight i don't want to do any of it i don't want it but like to to like look how I want to look, I have to, and it's so jarring. But I'm trying M Sculpt, um, and actually, it's my second session of M Sculpt, and I'll tell you all about this in like a minute or so. Um, and I'm having that treatment today, and I'm also doing radio frequency and like body contouring. So I'll show you my, me doing that this week later on. Um, but I have a session this morning, and then I'm going to go shopping, and then um, I have a really cool event tomorrow that I'm hopefully going to like bring you guys along with me um on so right now i'm going to do a lateral flow test and then i'm going to get dressed and then i'm going to go ahead and make my way out i'm officially a pro at doing this at this point in time um and i do this usually before i go out but also because i know i'm going to an event and they require me to do this before i go so yeah that's it i always have this one moment where i'm like what if i'm positive positive Okay, negative, excellent. So I have got some deliveries and I'm so excited. So I'm gonna do a little unboxing with you guys. Is there anyone else who just gets a nice unbox boxing? I picked up this dress. It's like a very 80s power shoulders dress and it's in this bright purple because I also picked up a bag from Jackmas that like matches with it and now I'm going to be that kind of auntie who matches her bag to her dress, to her shoes as well. But I saw this and I was like, oh my god, I'm in love. So this is another item I picked up from Jackmas. <laughs> Do you see the vibe? Do you catch the vibe? It's like the purple, it's really fun and right now I really love colours, like I'm just a colour girl ever since I got my like red bag and I'm just like let me get into the colours, even if I wear like plain black, having a colourful look just hits and I thought oh could this be too much purple, maybe together it's doing too much, I don't know, we'll see what this looks like, listen don't let the satin shiny grandma's curtain vibe for you this is gonna look really good on okay now i'm so excited for this this is new in from ghd you guys know i'm a ghd ambassador and i'm sponsored by them and they've been telling me about this product coming in for the longest and it's basically unplugged on the go cordless Styler, um, they have got their new cordless styler. All oh, this box is so luxurious. It is tiny. Oh my gosh, I love super small plates because that's how you get really tight right to the roots. Like I love small plates like this. It might just fit into my Jackmas bag, maybe just about. So this actually has a USB-C charger, which means you can plug it into the car, your laptop, on the go with the portable chargers as well. This is so, so cool. And it gives you 20 minutes of styling. And I'm the kind of person, I carry everything and the kitchen sink out with me. And yes, I might have like a small bag with me, like this, but I often carry like a tote bag as well, so I can have more stuff. So here's what this dress looks like on. Oh, okay, I'm gonna try and step back for you guys. Why do I love it though? Why do I love the shoulders? I love the size. It's just the vibe. I'm gonna have to show this to you in the mirror so you can see properly. I just love it with the bag. They go so perfectly together and I love purple right now. Should we just accept it? Oh no, I love it, I love it. 
Yeah, it works for me. This works for me. This works for me, yes. It's working, it's working. Okay, I'm done. It's time for me to get out on the town. I didn't actually think about this. I'm wearing a dress and there's no dressing gown and I have to be naked. I think I'll just pull my dress up, I think. And I've got my shapewear on as well. But this is the M Sculpt machine. Um, this is my second time doing it. My core currently hurts quite a bit, but we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna have a treatment here on my stomach. And you can see, lying down, it's not that bad. Just wrinkles and loose skin. But it works the core muscles deep inside. So I'm just waiting for the machine to cool down and I'm gonna do that next. first starting out but eventually you kind of get used to it and I felt like I got used to it I went on my phone and it was just going and my core feels so strong after doing this so I finished my treatment I'll give you updates on it when I'm home later on I'm actually gonna go shopping also um, I get the train everywhere all the time because um, I'm that kind of girl <laughs> but I literally just had like a guy sit like across from me and like very obviously like take a photo of me and he's definitely not like he doesn't know who I am or anything like that but I thought it was just so weird but I have a feeling he liked my bag because when I put my bag on my lap he like took a picture of the bag and I think or of me holding the bag and I think hopefully he's sending it to his girlfriend to tell her oh is this the bag that you want that's what I'm hoping but like I felt very uncomfortable uh, it is what it is. Uh, I'm back. Yes. I'm back home now. Back to the fun that is kids. B. B. All right, go find the B. When I come in, I get changed into the most casual clothes. My abs are doing the kind of like, ooh, ooh, <laughs> like it feels like I've done the hardest workout. I'm gonna eat my dinner, some chicken, broccoli, and potatoes. You know, just keeping it healthy. I'm just gonna chill out tonight. And then I'll catch you tomorrow. Morning. I am literally, oh, what? Oh, I need to go. I'm getting ready to go. I have my on the go, which I'm so excited to literally use out and about. I'm just gonna bring, bring the USB-C cable. I didn't wear that dress. I have this blazer that I like instead. And I think for sure I'm going with this bag and it goes together. So we are gonna roll just like this. I'm good to go. Just arrived. Don't, you, you, don't worry, it's alright if you photo bomb. <laughs> We're here. We've got a fleet of cars that have picked us all up. Um, these are gorgeous on the inside. Do what you want, honey. So just like a like... nice like 70s bang. That's what Do I want. Do you want it kind of flicked back that way? Yeah, that way. Not out. Not out. Just in post, yeah. <laughs> How it's like just like yeah, yeah, yeah. frame it and then even this bit's cute because it just hits your jaw. Yeah, that's what I want. Do you know what I mean? Wow. And you've just got that. And it is a flat wave. Literally a flat wave. But it's because you're a professional. This is what you do. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? It's great. And when I do it, it doesn't look like this. But no, this is great. Thank you. It's yeah, so cute on you. Love that. Cute. We have a ride. This gorgeous spot. It is absolutely stunning. Uh, we're doing a puzzle hunt, is it? Yes, a jigsaw puzzle jigsaw hunt. Jigsaw puzzle hunt, puzzle hunt. And people are getting their hair done. Oh, it's just such a nice feeling just to be out and about with other people. Yeah, that Lovely. This is the dinner table. This is the setting. I've got Nikita sitting opposite me. There was a big vase in the way, but it's gone now. So I can see a lovely face. Going 
and having a reflection. Look at me, look at me, about to be a baby. people. Put on the back of your heads in the vlog, but hey, drink of water. Really good time, and we're in the car on my way back home. It was so good to literally go out, see everyone, talk and actually try a new product as well. I love like seeing and feeling and touching new stuff and I'm going to go in and literally like just play with it more. Although I'm getting braids tomorrow, I can definitely see me using um, the curler on the go or the unplugged. Really excited for it. It's great. It's great. Love it. Love, I love this part of my job. It's like just playing with products playing with new products and seeing how they work and seeing them out and about and being aware of what's going on is just mind-blowing um yesterday was really good fun it feels so weird to just be out and about and interacting again and it's really tiring actually i felt exhausted today i'm having hifu which is high intensity frequency ultra therapy or something like that this is to help with the skin tightening and fat loss and it uses radio frequency to kind of um, tighten your skin and like make it all snatched, right? And really helps with like, not stretch marks, but loose skin. So I have a lot of loose skin on my stomach at the moment. We'll see. Anyway, I'm off. So I feel like we should call today to this video like transformation in every way. Um, the throw is out again because I'm getting braids now. And you guys remember I cut my hair off last year. And that's what I love about hair. It grows, it grows back. Um, even though I've had like kind of a few issues with my scalp and stuff, when I actually take out my cornrows, I'm always glad to be like, oh my gosh, like there's a little bit of growth going on. I'm gonna wash it blow dry it and I've got Nads here who's gonna give me the cutest little braid style. I'm gonna show you how that magic happens. Like even my edges have filled up so much. I'm so happy. After the wash, we shrink and then we blow dry this out. Nads is giving me the longest braids. Look at this. <laughs> so I love it. Oh, we've got a little blondes in there. Just one or two. I can't wait for this. I'm literally trying to book a holiday right now because when you have like braids, like this is not for England, this is not for London, this needs to be on the beach somewhere. Can we get into it? Like somewhere else needs to see this, not here. Okay guys, it's literally a few days later. <laughs> oh my gosh, we ended up braiding into the night, but I love my results, oh my gosh. This is literally like three days later, and I can't lie. <laughs> I couldn't sleep. The braids are heavy. They've added three pounds to my my body weight. It's a lot. It's a lot. Hold on. Let me get a box to put you on. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Nadine is amazing. You have to follow her on Instagram if you're ever looking for a really talented and excellent braid art. She is the one to go to. So I thought I would actually share a little bit more about why I'm having these treatments that I'm having because I think by the time I'm in flow I don't really give you a lot of details but like I'm basically not going to have any forms of surgery and like I'm currently choosing not to do that and I don't know what it is right is that I'm at this point in time where it's, I've actually been like if you have a problem with your body you want to change it change it like make it do what feels good for you but then I also understand that there's this like pressure for perfectionism all the time on so many people and I recognize that almost like I've been one of the people who have perpetuated it but I'm also a woman I'm also a mum I'm also someone who has insecurities I'm also someone who wants to try and improve myself as best as I can to make sure I feel comfortable and I love beauty and I love trying treatments but I'm going down a route that is a little bit different I wanted to go this time down a non-invasive cosmetic treatment route to see what the options are for myself but also you know for those of you who watch me I am not against like cosmetic surgery at all listen I've had a live action I've had a boob job like literally like seven years ago so I'm not averse to it and I understand how quick you can get results um but 
I can tell you now that it's the worst thing is to be uncomfortable in your body. And everyone can say, you know, exercise, eat healthy, yada, yada, yada. Like, but I just, you don't understand how people may feel when they're just not feeling right in their skin, particularly because your body changes. No matter whether you have children or not, women's bodies change so, so much. And there is like a standard of how you wanna look, right? And how you wanna be perceived. I get it, and this is what so many mums have, is that like your, your belly just changes so much. Like you could be as skinny as a twig and you may not necessarily get a snack back and you have to go down quite extreme like exercising and eating routines to snap back and it might not happen okay and there's so much information where everybody's got like this perfect shape and this perfect body and it's like oh, i'm not looking like that like i'm not and i feel that and i feel that so i'm going down this route for now um i i mentioned before that i was almost on the surgeon's table ready to get a tummy tuck and it didn't happen and i've decided to go down this route for a season now so yeah that's it really i'm gonna end this video here and i don't want people to feel under pressure to do what i do do what feels good to you know what your options are and then make the choice that is right for you okay guys thank you for watching i would love to also hear what do you want to see and hear from me next are there any burning questions that you have any key insights you want i really want to like come back and not just vlog i want to like deliver like really good content that i just enjoy as well and for me i know people love reviews and love clothing but i try to purchase like a little less <laughs> a little less manically although there's a pile of, of um zara clothes here um but like i feel like i've slightly changed in that aspect but i think there's some next level stuff that you guys will want and i'm gonna give it to you if you want it okay guys thank you for watching i'll see you all later bye